Welcome, everybody, to All About Articulation, where we do a deeper dive into the articulation of some of your favorite action figures while glossing over things like sculpt, paint apps, character history, accessories, because I suck at that. And there are already so many great reviews on YouTube who do that already, so I don't want to waste your time. Today, we are reviewing the Hasbro Marvel Legends Spider Shot and Scarlet Spider, the re-release on the uh, Renew Your Vows, this one is on the Renew, Renew Your Vows Spider-Man buck, and this one is on the Retro Spidey buck, which is, for all intents and purposes, the exact same thing. Uh, but, 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 there are a couple of differences, and not I'm not just talking about the uh, toe articulation on the Renew Your, Renew Your Vows buck. Um, so yeah, I'm going to jump right into the articulation, and then stick around at the very end for the what you call it, uh, my final thoughts and spiel, and uh, I'm currently, I'm traveling at the moment, I'm on the west coast, I'm staying at my uh, relative's house, um, I, I brought a couple of action figures with me, because to keep me company, because I had a lot of downtime here, so I figure I'll slap a couple of videos on, and, 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 and do a couple of reviews, I did not bring these, however, uh, originally, to California, I actually picked them up here in California, because uh, I'm originally from New York City, and shout out to New York City, we just had an earthquake this morning, I don't know if you guys know that, uh, 4.8, thank God, not a lot of damage happened, but it just freaked the hell out of a lot of people, anyway, um, what was I saying, oh yeah, California, so much better than New York, New York, as everybody knows, or maybe some of you who don't know, we have awful toy options, in terms of Target, Walmart, any of the, you know, big brand, you know, box stores, we have, n n there's no, 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 no toy hunting, you, you gotta get everything online, aside from the few local comic book shops where they kind of charge you a premium, so you might be paying it a little bit more, but if you just want to stroll into your local Target or Walmart and grab an action figure, good luck, but I'm out here in California, and what do I do, walk into a Target, see these two guys sitting there, boom, you know, that's why, you got you need you need to travel, folks. <laughs> that's that's bottom line. My bottom line. Okay, let's get to the articulation. So we we, we know this. All right, I don't. It's going to be a double review because it's so similar. There's really nothing to review that you guys don't already know. If you want to know the intricacies of these figures, I've done reviews on other figures as well. The black suit Spider Man, the uh, the retro Spider Man, Ben Riley, uh, all that. It's the exact same thing. So I'm not going to waste your time. The only thing is that spider shot um oddly enough has a has a i don't know hip articulation that's atypical to this body mold and specifically it's that he could cross he has a lot of range he has a lot of um sort of hip range here and by that i mean he could cross his ankles like very very well both both ways, left over right and right over left. Um, however, he does not have a lot of range going outwards, so he can't really do a split. This is as far out as he can go in terms of uh, his split. Let me let me move Scarlet out the way so you can see that better. There you go. That's as far about it that you can go, but you can't really, but you can go way far in. I don't know why that is. Um, as opposed to Scarlet Spider, if you look, he can go much, much further out in terms of the split. Like, that's 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 how far out the Scarlet can go, but Spider Shot can go and go that far. But the reverse is true for him. He can cross his legs and his ankles very, very well. If you look at the, at the line, if you were created like an imaginary line down his left shoulder, his right ankle could cross beyond his left shoulder. And likewise, his left ankle could cross beyond his right shoulder. That, there's an imaginary line going down from his left right shoulder. His left ankle can go beyond that. Very weird how that happens. However, you look at S Scarlet Spider, that he cannot do that. This is literally as far as it goes. I'm pushing it with all my might and all my strength and he can't even touch his ankles for that matter so yeah and i'm looking at it as wondering why why that is and i'm looking at the crotch piece and the crotch piece is exact the exact same size it's not like spider shot has a thinner 
uh, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to say <laughs> in case kids are watching this, but you know what I'm saying. This part here is the exact same width and thickness as this part here. Um, hey, genetics, what are you going to say? What are you, you going to do? But so I think what it is, is that the peg and there are, and there is drop down, by the way, there's a, there, there's a drop, what do you call it? Drop down uh, mechanism, drop down hips. I think the peg for the drop down hit is longer in spider shot. I'm guessing that's the only thing I can think of that can make him cross over, that can create the range that allows spider shot to cross his ankles. You know what I'm saying? As opposed to uh, Scarlet Spider, not so much. Um, what are other differences? Of course, we know that the, uh, Scarlet, because he's on Renew Your Vows, has the toe articulation. Um, but that's about it. Um, in terms of uh, ab crunch, the biggest question I had, my biggest concern when I saw the pre-release photos of uh, Scarlet Spider was that I was afraid that his ab articulation would be hindered. He's got a floating belt, by the way. This is great. It's not sculpted in, so you could definitely slide it down and then utilize the articulation. So that does not get hindered. Um, I thought that this piece here, the, the sweatshirt piece, hoodie, would be... I was afraid that it would be too thick and hinder articulation. But of course, uh, Hasbro, you know, good for them, good on them. They, they anticipated that, so they made this very, very soft. So it doesn't hinder articulation too much. He can bend down this much, utilizing just the, the crunch, the, uh, the... Is that the wheel? What is that? The hinge? The hinge of the lower ab. He can go down that far, and he can extend that far. Now, just utilizing the upper ball joint, he can go down this far and go back. I'm trying very hard not to bend the lower, the lower articulation point. He can go back that far. So, altogether, he can do this. Really nice. You know, and I'm trying not to bend his legs to cheat. So, he can bend that far down. Really nice. Um... But it does absolutely hinder his butterfly motion. You know, he cannot go forward too much. What I had intended to do was that I'm going to go on eBay and buy, or some Etsy, eBay, I'm, I'll look around, to find a six-inch, a soft goods, six-inch six scale Scarlet Spider hoodie. They sell them all over the place. They're about between $50 to $20. I think I'm going to do that. But of course, first, I have to take this off. Um, and you know what? I think I'm going to do that here. I'm going to do that on camera. All right, here goes nothing. You guys want to see it? Ah, what the hell. Let's do it. Oops. All right. Heated it up. Now it's nice and soft. I'm going to use my little knife. My little, I, 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 I want the knife, please. A million extra points to whoever can tell me what movie that's referenced to. All right, here goes nothing. If I start bleeding, well, if I start bleeding, the blood is just going to mix right in with the red paint anyway, right? So <laughs> it, won't be, it won't be too bad. Okay, here we go. Please, Lord. Oh, wow, it really is. The plastic is already very soft, so just by heating it up just a little bit, it's, it almost, I really don't want to damage the figure, so you know what, how the hell with it, I'm just going to cut it through. Can you see it? Am I on camera? How am I looking? Okay, I'm back. I actually had to go off camera, find myself a sharper knife, and uh, finish doing the, the deed. Uh, that's why they say... Duller knives are more dangerous than sharper knives, and I totally see why, because I almost, almost sliced my finger open before. So I went downstairs to the kitchen, found a, a sharper knife, uh, heated the plastic up a little bit more, and now I got that, uh, I, I got that cut off. Uh, didn't damage the figure, thank goodness. Didn't cut myself, thank goodness. And uh, if I ever wanted to kind of put this back on, I can always just you know do a little super glue there. And uh, it should be fine. All right, so I haven't even taken it off yet. I'm doing this for the first time on camera. Gonna have to yank the head off, right? 
and uh, let's see let's see how this goes let's see how it looks without the oh look at that hmm so it is completely like yeah there we go <laughs> so looks like a red naked man <laughs> without the spider logo he just looks like a naked dude without the nipples of course because you know God forbid anybody sees nipples. Oh, it's going to ruin the youth of America. So yeah, it's exact same body. Um, not any thinner than I thought. Yeah, and you can tell too. It's the exact same uh, body because he's got those two little... See those dots? Can you see it on the camera there? Oh, let, me, let, me get that, let me get that light better for you. There we go. There, you know. You got the, the two dots there. And all the other uh, musculature and all the lines, it's the exact same thing. So it's the same figure. Um, but yeah, that's how it looks. So I'm going to go on eBay or whatever, like I said, and buy a, a soft goods blue hoodie. And uh, it shouldn't hinder the articulation more than, uh, more than necessary. And now he's, he has full range of motion without any articulation hindrances from the plastic hood and uh yeah so all right i guess i'm already kind of going into final thoughts about these figures um for 25 dollars, yeah definitely i mean scarlet spider you know ben riley scarlet spider he's a must-have for me anyway um i love this retro spidey body mold it's fantastic i just think that the Typical Marvel Legends ab crunch with the hinge is just passe. It's 2024. That was amazing back in, no pun intended, that was amazing back in 2014. But 10 years later, we're talking about, it's got, come on, we, we need the ball joint. We need to be able to do like this. You know what I mean? Like, we need to be able to do that. Huh? How cool is that? Um, what was my point? Yeah, Spider Shot, I was, I looked at him, I thought, I don't really know this figure, I don't know this character, I don't know anything about him. He looks cool though, but do I want to buy him for $25? I don't know. And I saw him sitting there, in hand, just fantastic. And he does come with the retro, uh, this was the box that he came in. So it's, it's, a, it's a, you know, the retro uh, um, packaging design. Um, didn't know he was a, a, a classic retro figure, but what do I know? I'm glad I got him. I'm glad I got him. Who is it for? I guess it's anybody who likes Spider-Man, you know? Um, the only thing, the, my only one qualm about him is that he's got these two finger pointy, I guess, gun hands. And I wish they were the, uh, oh God, what is this called? Oh, I just called the up and down motion or the side to side motion as opposed to the up and down because right now he can only do this and that, which is fine, you know, but I wish he could do up and down, but that's a minor gripe. That's my only gripe about Spider Shot. Otherwise, great figure, love him, love the design. Just, that's just such a clean, nice look. Anyway, not going to go f too much into character design or accessories, but yeah. Those are my final thoughts. Uh, pick these guys up. I highly recommend them. They, they can do basically anything that the Retro Spidey can do. So if you know the Retro Spidey articulation, you know what these guys are capable of. Just with the minor little things here and there that I pointed out in this video. Okay. All right. I long, rambled long enough. I, I got to go. Bye-bye.